Two Boca Ciega high school students are now under arrest. They're accused of passing out drug-laced candy that sent four of their classmates to the hospital. ABC Action News reporter Cameron Pullum is live tonight with some new developments. Cameron? Ashley, those two students, a 15-year-old and a 16-year-old, facing felony drug dealing charges tonight in Gulfport. A third arrest is expected to happen tomorrow morning. They're all charged and accused of giving out drug-laced, marijuana-laced gummy worms at Boca Ciega High School Monday. Now, seven students in all knowingly ate the drug-laced candy. Four ended up getting sick and going to the hospital. Now, but recognizing the difference between a normal piece of candy or snack and the marijuana laced ones isn't always easy. This video released today showing seemingly normal looking Apple Jacks, Rice Krispie Treats, lollipops and gummies. However, they're all laced with marijuana. Investigators say parents need to be diligent in keeping these products away from their kids. It's Talk not just gummy bit. worms, it's hard candy, it's brownies, cookies, sodas. Uh, you can go online and look it up and it comes in a variety of different forms. Police say one way to tell is know the smell. Each one of those products is, has a strong and distinct odor of marijuana. Now, of the seven students who actually ate that marijuana laced candy, none will face criminal charges. However, they all will face consequences from school officials. In Gulfport tonight, I'm Cameron Polam, ABC Action News.